we continue in worship this morning, we're going to have our baptism. And um, so uh, we have the, uh, it's always the butcher family to me. But anyway, Jim and Julie, come on up. And where's the, where's, where's, there's, there's, where's your wife? Oh, there she is. There's Sarah. Okay. Is I here? All right, good. All right, so um, first of all, baptism is a sacrament of the church. The Lord Jesus Christ is the one who instituted the sacrament of baptism. It's a sign to be placed upon all those who believe in Jesus Christ and their household. We see that uh, of all the baptism experiences that's recorded in the book of Acts, the majority of those are household baptisms. And so the idea that the children of believers uh, are members of the church. They're part of the church family. They're part of the, the church life. And so we recognize this by giving, uh, administering the sacrament of baptism. Now, again, let's get all, all of our everything straight. You know, baptism doesn't save you. All right. And second of all, there's nothing special about the water. Uh, there's nothing special about the fellow who administers the baptism. So it's all just a recognition of following the commands of Christ and to be able to signify that uh, children of believers are part of the family of God. Amen. And so with it, today is a special uh, baptism. Um, Jim and Julie were uh, founding members of, of this church back in the uh, 1990s. And uh, so uh, thrilled. This is their daughter, Sarah. And this is Justin, uh, the, the dad. Uh, so um, and this is Finley. All right. And so we're really thrilled. Now, I had to verify the fact but, uh, that I actually uh, administered baptism to Sarah. All right. And so you see that the generation here of uh, that this promises to you and to your children, to all those who are far off, as many as the Lord God calls to himself. Amen. So it's a it's a special, special blessing. Also, Jimmy was uh, a part of the first uh, deacon uh, class that was ordained for this church and then went on to serve as an elder. And then he ran away from us after several years. <laughs> But anyway, so but we're, 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 we're thrilled. All right. <laughs> so, Justin and Sarah, let me ask you some questions here. Do you acknowledge your child's need for the work of salvation in her heart? Do you? Yes. And do you look in faith to the Lord Jesus uh, Christ for her salvation when one day she will profess Jesus Christ as her own Lord and Savior? Do you? And do you now unreservedly dedicate your child to God and promise and humble reliance upon the Holy Spirit that you will endeavor to set before her a godly example, that you will pray with and for her, and that you will teach her God's word, and that you will strive by all the means of God's appointment to bring her up in the nurturement and admonition of the Lord. Do you? Yes. All right. And do you as a congregation, since we're all uh, one church family, do you as a under congregation undertake the responsibility of assisting these parents in the Christian nurture of this child? Do you? Yes. There is the body of Christ. So Finley Sawyer. All right. Let's get this done. Come close. And, and you, all right. Finley Sawyer, as a minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ, I now baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit. Lord God, we just pray that you'll bless her and keep her. you make your face to shine upon her. Lord God, work wonders in her life. And we thank you for this time and that you brought her to us. And we give you praise in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Let's give the Lord praise.